In today's video, I'll be showing you how to adjust kerning in Adobe InDesign. If you don't already have Adobe InDesign, you can get it by clicking the link down in the description. So as you can see, we have our text right here. And let's say that we want to kern some of these letters. All we actually have to do is first create our text, of course, as you can see right here. And from here, you want to go over to the toolbar in the left side of the screen and choose the type tool. And from here, you want to choose a letter you would like to kern. So let's just say that I want to just kern the space between the K and the E right here. I can actually just select between these two right here. And I can go up in the top bar and go over right here where it says kerning. And if I now click on this up arrow, you can see that I'm now kerning the text and adjusting the space between these two letters. And I can also decrease the space. And I can also just, if I click on this arrow right here, choose either optical, which is great in many examples, or I can also choose this matrix right here. So if I just choose optical, it has just adjusted this kerning to optical. And you can just select any space between two letters. So yeah, that's actually how to kern text in Adobe InDesign. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.